Hi, biologists. This is Miss R, and I'm here in the Galapagos Islands at a tortoise reserve with a giant Galapagos tortoise. And this tortoise is a great example of evolution and adaptive radiation. This tortoise here is adapted to this particular island. We're on Santa Cruz right now. It's a dome-shaped tortoise and very large because there's lots of food. You can see this is kind of a tropical environment where tortoises have lots to snack on. In other islands, the shell of the tortoise and the size of the tortoise is very different. In fact, the word Galapagos means saddle because on one of the Galapagos Islands, the tortoises are smaller and the shape of their shell is more like a saddle. And this is so that um, on the island where there are less there are less food, the tortoises can reach further. Their, their shell curves up so their head can reach for reach longer for more food. Um, tortoises are a great example of evolution and it's what Charles Darwin, one of the things that formed his original theory of evolution because every island has a different kind of tortoise with a different kind of shell adapted for that particular environment. Because the environments here in the Galapagos on different islands can be very different. Um, so this is Miss R with a Galapagos giant tortoise signing off.